he's a good character, and then he's getting the exposure he needs, but in like a fair type of way. Mm. Arson could like really uh, destroy a lot of people, though. Speaking of Arson, I wonder. If but it's not like he has it all the time. <laughs> yeah, and he can't charge it either. He has to kind of work for it. Anyways, here we go though. Grand Finals. Charlie is on winner's side. He is the one that sent Nico into losers. So let's see how this goes down between these two players. And so far it's going down that 41% uh, has already been tacked on Nico. Charlie looking really confident in his combo game and how he's approaching uh, Nico in the matchup so far. Yeah, okay, these guys are playing much faster than they did in the winner's side. Yeah. Before they were expecting each other a lot more in neutral, just kind of like walking back and forth, not really throwing anything out preemptively. But now they're just like, I'm gonna get in their face and just force these tech chases and go in as much as possible. Right. Now they're starting to be a little bit more careful now that the percent's gone up a little bit. Yeah, just straight hits off of each other. Nothing too crazy. Oh, that was nice. Spacing them out. Not quite going to be able to get the kill yet. The directional air dodge kind of saved Charlie at the very last second there. I thought he was dead from that, yeah. but not quite. Okay. Almost getting that neutral good up punch with the up smash. Mm -hmm. He had the right idea of getting that cross up too, but not quite there yet. Okay, there's more stage. Ooh. Wow, I really like that. Wow, I really <laughs> love that punish. He parried such a far away hitbox and then ran up and up tilted. Yeah, he, really he, just, he just ran up up tilt. Yeah, that was that was pretty crazy. Yeah, parrying max range uh, Shulk back air. That, that's a really hard move to punish otherwise. Right. And you got to kill off of it. Was yeah, very nice stuff. Okay. Still living here. There's a slight shine stall. Goes low. I like it. I like that Charlie makes it really hard to tell when he's going to go for the side beat to recover. Right. Wolf's aerial mobility is just so good. Oh, he tried to go for the down smash. Oh, oh he got left for it again. All righty. Get, yeah. get off my stage. Yeah. Says Charlie. Charlie has a very comfortable lead right now. And oh. he's going to get that combo in on Buster Art. Gets 35% yeah. off of three fares. You do take extra percent when you're in Buster Art, by the way. Yep. In case you didn't know. Mm -hmm. Usually, the, uh, the easiest way to think about it is like, okay, what does Shulk gain? He probably suffers from that, too. Like, yeah. Especially like Smash Art. He will receive more knockback as well, et cetera, et cetera. Charlie kind of overextending with that up B gets punished. Nico trying to see if he can force him to drop shield and get a forward airstring off stage. Down throw. Nice. Catches the spot dodge. Okay. Big damage. Double up in the buzzer. Triple. Or sorry, it goes for the forward but still. That's huge percent. Is that going to be a. What? What? That was, <laughs> that was, that was it? <laughs> wow. wow. That was an amazing string from Nico. Yeah. With so many punches on air dodge completely trapped him to the other side of the stage. I think it was over after those double up airs on the on the platform. Yeah, that, and Nico felt himself Buster a little Art. bit too hard after that. That was crazy. Dang. Doing all that work in Buster Art was clean. Yeah, very nice stuff. Wow. That was great. Game one going to Nico trying to get this reset on and popping. Mm -hmm. It's the first step, man. It's getting one game. Back on PS2, Charlie's gonna run it back. Which, uh, I don't blame him. Honestly, that game was going back and forth until that last moment. Nico just went crazy on that, that string. Yeah, there was no clear advantage from either one. I think Charlie had it for a little while, and then all of a sudden, just Nico's decided, nope, uh, I'm gonna <laughs> win that game there instead. Waits out a double jump. Oh, <laughs> decides a laser to cover the yeah. landing. That was smart. Yeah, I thought we'd go a little bit more aggressive there, but, you know, it's nothing too unsafe to go for. Yep. Right? Mm -hmm. Oh, did you catch the jump? Not quite dead yet. Yeah, he uses a wolf flash. He picks the quicker option so that he doesn't get caught up on startup. Oh, he doesn't block the second hit of the downer there and just goes super deep off stage. And I like the choice to switch the jump bar so he can make it back after getting that uh, forward air kill off stage. That was really good stuff from Nico. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's low profiling the back there with the down so really yeah, smart stuff. It looked like a dance almost like you know like when you sweep underneath the, yeah. your opponent's leg or whatever. Nice, really patient play from Miko. He's just waiting out his opportunity. He's swinging safely on Charlie's shield, retreating away from the throttle move, and then he goes in from there. Yeah. 
Nico, I think, just off that run to loser's bracket, all of a sudden it's got a lot of momentum going for him and feeling a lot better about it. He even rolled the right way, too. He got the read, just at the wrong timing. Backer finally going to be able to do it, though. Nice. He knew where he was going to roll, catches the grab. Now he has a smash arc. Oh, just such good spacing, man. Called out Charlie's dashing with the pivot F tilt. This is a place that I like to see from Nico, where it just looks like every time you try to inch close to him, you get hit. Yeah. See what Charlie can do here, though. He's struggling to open up Nico. There's that blaster, a little bit more in line than it did be had before. So if he just throws it when he's uh, too close to Nico, he can definitely get punished for it. Oh, the smash artist in. Oh, oh the fourth smash. Man, really good positioning. Again, just dashing right outside of range where Charlie wants to approach. Oh, that could have been it. That could have been it too, but... Yeah, very close. It's not quite. Oh, he's trying to look for the down smash, but no tech oh, option there. Covering the landing air dodge with the down smash. Going to go for another one. Oh, misses his nair grab. Unfortunate for Charlie. He's trying to get something started, but Nico's just making it so difficult for him to get anything substantial. But it's a good dash attack. Nice nair okay, test recovery. Yeah. He's still going to make it back. Oh, Ooh. what a punish. Yeah. Cross stage, still not enough to do it. Nope, no vision there. Next okay, okay, the yeah. back that, that time he doesn't pull the trigger too early, so he's able to get the oh. stock. Oh, oh, but he rolls matter. right into he the just covers so. a roll immediately. Smash art, up tilt, insanely powerful move. Nico getting two games up now. One more for the reset. And lose back in Nico's kind of scary, man. <laughs> yeah, Charles or Char Charles. Charlie's really thinking about. Oh, he's going to approach this next match, it looks like. Yeah, especially after Charlie beat him in winners, too. It was pretty dominant as well, from what I remember. Sticking with the wolf. He's going to try it one more time with just a deep breath. Collect himself. He, he's got to consider that he still has the reset possible. Yeah. If like, it doesn't work out three times in a row with wolf, then maybe he can think about opting for other strategies but right now you just think about okay if i tweak up my game plan just a little bit see how it goes mm. so far doesn't look like it's going too well already at 70 percent almost got edge guarded there looking real rough so far yeah, just jumps out of there not going to give charlie opportunity to go for any type of follow-up i had the right idea reading that back here but he's still getting a lot of damage off of it 59 percent already so far Alright, Charlie's trying to get, uh, trying to, like, not necessarily space in a way that's easy for Nico to throw out his moves. I think he's, what he should be doing is try to get closer and punish the startup of, uh, Shulk's arrows a little bit more. N not necessarily jump into him with a hitbox, but just, like, dash up and see if he throws out a move and then punish from there. Uh-huh. Okay. Opportunity? Oh, he went oh, really low man. on that. I think he was just scared of Nico's pressure. Yeah, that's, uh, that's something that you have to keep in mind. Because you can cover so much area when you shift a certain way to recover that you try to mix it up by going like low and you can't make it back. You saw that, you saw that happen with uh, Mass tomorrow as well. Yeah. I mean, I think they're trying to take your advice. They're kind of just standing there waiting for the other person to do something first rather than trying to intercept, but it doesn't quite look like it's working out. Nice, just in the buster again, all the percent he needs. Charlie trying to get something to start with that rogue wolf flash, but Nico is just playing really patient right now. Yep. Four tilt, not quite enough. Can he get the ledge trap with another four tilt? No, not quite. Oh, okay. That stack finally will be able to do it on the damage. He's some good forward air streams from Charlie. He's trying to pressure as much as he can. He's not really getting like his uh, grab that his grab follow-ups after the fairs I was expecting to see, but yeah. decent enough for what he can get right here. Mm -hmm. Just waiting, yeah, intercepting him with the blaster again. Very nice stuff. Now he's got the ledge control. Oh wow, he just really wanted it with that forward smash. Yeah, the side charge and everything. Yeah. Anything to get an earlier stock just so we can get back in the lead here. Mm -hmm. I mean, he's slowly, he's brought back the percents already. He hasn't been touched too hard. And now all of a sudden, oh, okay, there we go. Putting him off stage one more time. 
No edge guard opportunity. Careful with the smash shot. Oh, the forwarder is barely missing. Yeah, auto cancel a little bit too early. Oh, there it is. The jump bar goes super deep off stage, covering the recovery almost immediately. Yeah, very but very nice. nice. Sneaks in that back right taking no percent charge, but even this up really quick. Keeping it close as much as he can. Alrighty, just getting that small damage extra with the blaster. And he just goes in with the like intercepting air to air with the fair and he's able to get a lot of damage off of that. The fact of the matter is, can he close the stock with it though? Because Nico's been doing a much better job with that. Yeah, it's just uh, it's been really hard for him to get like these like down smashes or any smash attacks to really kill early. While well, Nico just all he needs is a few hits to throw him off stage, and he's just been really consistent at edge guarding. Uh huh. Fade back fair. Yeah, he's really wait. He's just waiting patiently for Charlie's option to try and intercept or burst, and then he's uh, following up accordingly with a good punish. That time got a little nice. bit greedy, and that time Charlie all of a sudden now has the positioning for it. Okay. Glitch here covers the jump. Air Good dodge, trying to go through everything here. Nice, lands on the platform. He's not going to yeah. be able to punch the landing. Very nice stuff. Definitely caught Nico off guard. Oh, well, he drops shield too early, now he has to deal with jump. Goes too fast on that uh, forward air swing. Great parry into the dash attack. Charlie. Back up so he can, nice. He sees he can actually get some good grabs while he's in shield. But Nico, making this really close right here. Yep. He's almost there, just trying to figure out his way in. Actually, both of these two. Back throw? Oh, uh, he's looking for that pummel, and then he didn't get the back throw up in time. That's a bad trade for Nico here. Oh, man, this is so close. Next yeah. big hit should do it for either guys. Yeah, even if he gets a strong oh. hit. Oh, it goes for down tilt. Missed input for the down smash? I think it was. Oh, but the up B still doing it, Charlie. Oh my god, Charlie. <laughs> the up B poking <laughs> through the ledge. Oh my goodness. He looks like he he's just like <laughs> <laughs> And then Nico was like the oh, that was that was such a BS space. I can't like, believe that's how it ends. Oh my god. Like the Darrier Looked like it was gonna come out, and then he was like, Oh, psych, Wolf Up B still works in this patch. And said, Yep. It doesn't I'm take that. It doesn't go as far through the ledge as it used to, but that was just enough for it to poke to kill. That's crazy. Charlie with a sigh of release. He's still in it. Yeah. He's, I think he's treating this first set of grand finals like it's the last one. And then. Uh, so just so that he can try and just get the win right away, rather than treating it as one long set to get it down. Yeah, though. yeah. I mean, you don't ever want to, you know, give your, oppo your opponent a chance to reset. If you can just close out in one set, you should definitely go for that. Because the person that gets the reset usually has the momentum going into the next set anyway. That's very true. Let's see if Nico can uh, clutch this out, though. But Dan, Charlie! Bad back there, really. that first stock super quick. Yeah, that, that's just went right into Nico's face. I don't think he was expecting that at all. Okay. Smash art opportunity though. This is his forward air. Oh. He's just gonna, he doesn't go for the second swing. I, I don't know. I think Nick, I think Nico was a, a little bit mad that he missed his forward air on the earlier edge guard attempt and went really low without going for his, his uh, second swing of the air slash. That's unfortunate because you don't want to give Charlie a free opportunity to get the reverse 3-0. Yeah. Just as he was playing so well. Mm -hmm. I don't know why he didn't go for the second hit. That was the weird thing. I don't know if he just like didn't tap it correctly or something. That looked like a, this is a key missing miss input. And all of a sudden, Charlie, like you oh. said, can potentially bring it back. One star KO, but he's got two more to try and work with. And all of a sudden, yeah, just uh, with the angel platform invincibility. What's the option gonna be? Goes for the four smash. Oh, that time! Oh, but he mashes up B afterwards. Very smart from Charlie. Keeping himself oh, alive here. Watch the shield. Yeah. <laughs> See, he's gonna jump because he wants to replenish the shield a little bit. Gets covered by the neutral air. Oh, Charlie going for that up smash. Oh, Charlie's miss jump. tech! Oh, doesn't look for the down smash though. He doesn't commit to it. He's not confident in it. But he gets a back air trade, nice. and we're going to game five on set one of grand finals here. And Nico again looks not happy. 
at all. I call this yeah. emo Nico. It definitely <laughs> looks pretty. It definitely looks like Dark Nico right now. Yeah. Not gonna lie. <laughs> Tournaments are a uh, very strong test of endurance, <laughs> especially <laughs> if you're trying to end them in a reset. In how many games? Six games? Yeah. Just play like Charlie, especially the guy that you already lost to in winners. Mm -hmm. it takes a lot to download your opponent and come back from something like that. Yep. It's taking time to take a deep breath. Alrighty, both of us are going in here. Charlie's now all of a sudden got that reverse 3 0 momentum coming in, so it's gonna yeah. be interesting to see how this goes down. Nico already taking a slower pace in the match. Just waiting to see what his option is at the platform and then going in to see afterwards how he can try and get in. Charlie uh, hasn't really been getting like a lot of low percent combos. He's getting his little hit and going back in neutral, but it's isn't working really well because it lets him get the percent lead and then it forces Nico to try to approach him. But oh. there's the tech chase on the down smash. Yeah, every time. Stock, but oh, barely missing it. Yeah, every time Nico just oh. ooh. He still has his jump. He's oh, fine. Oh, the wolf flash, though. Yeah, every time Nico just texts in. I don't know why. It's like every match I've seen, he just texts in. I don't know if it's just like he's not holding a direction. Obviously, he's not holding a direction, but I guess he's not thinking about it. He's thinking really hard about the tech itself. So. Oh, that jump gets covered. Charlie sees it a mile away. Love smash. Taking the first stop. A right, big opportunity for Nico to get something. But not quite. Buster Art is pretty much gone, and now nice. he's got a big combo going in. And yeah, just go soon as Shield Art doesn't want to get hit anymore. Trying to even up the stocks here with the Smash Art. Charlie playing really patiently at the later. Like the neutral get up, or sorry, the get up attack. Having a. Pretty much goes through a lot of hitboxes in this game. I think he has right. more invincibility in this game than it usually did. Uh huh. Finally getting that stock though. Charlie's gonna do it. Uh, good job waiting out the speed. Yeah. Waiting on the angel platform. Ooh, Ooh! The charge on the neutral grip again gets covered. Charlie, man, he just knows the timing of that really well. Yeah, I, I, it looked like he just waited for a reaction. And he's just like, all right, I'm just gonna go for it. Like, and it worked out for him. So he's gonna be able to get some more damage. 60% already onto Nico. Yeah, Charlie's just playing this stock so well. Looking for his opportunity here. So is Nico though. He gets that nair. Doesn't get the back air though to set up for an offstage situation. Oh, just intercepting him with the nair. That was a great direction on your dodge recovery. And he gets to parry on that too. Charlie looking like he really wants to win this. Close it out now. And this is looking like his opportunity with another oh, up smash. Man. That's going to be it. The neutral get up gets caught out again. The up smash super strong for Charlie. And that's a really strong way to close out the tournament with the reverse 3-0. Not dropping into losers.